My friends, a day of new discover for me. First reaction ever, first reaction ever to Haken Ben. A Ben Haken that I will see them uh, performing live in Zurich June 14 with my friend Marco, that is also my former guitar player from my band um, Kids Rock. But I don't waste more time, long song, 11 minutes, almost 12 minutes, so I go immediately, I shift immediately to the song, go. A kind of a gra the grand conjuration, a kind of the grand conjuration by Opeth um, melody here, and the start is really a ginger style start. I mean, new metal um, because of the gloomy guitars. How are they doing fusion music here? Come on, this is fusion music. Jazzy vibes here. Against all its My God. Influences. He also kind of met Bellamy Muse kind of style of singing here. One Avenged Sevenfold singer now. Oh my god, this band is surprising for me. I'm full of wonder because I, I can I can feel a lot of influences all in a band, also Porcupine 3, also Porcupine 3 style in some transition. It's fusion, pure fusion music. Wow! Kind of a kind of opet sorceress song here. Opet sorceress. Cool. So good. Here the porcupine tree influence. Wow, magic song! I'm loving it! Wow, that's, that's 
Is here Mike Pornoy, Jordan Rudis and uh, John Mian, a rhythmical part with the keyboards of John Rudis Dream Theater. Wow, how much influence is in this band all in one? I'm loving Haken, first experience for me. Of course, I need some comparison, my friends. This is not offensive for Haken at all. At all, I, I, you're wrong. If you think that, you are really wrong. Uh, I, I need some comparison just for. Uh, for feeling, for feeling more comfortable with their proposal, with what they're doing actually in this song and in their music. Wow! Green Theater is tremendous in here. Oh my god! Oh! Something like <laughs> Yomo, I mean a, a famous bass player from Japan, Ayumu, a, a, a way of playing the bass, this kind of uh, oh, high tone sound of the bass, cool. I'm actually loving it! Badly! I can't sit down no more here! I just can't sit down no more here! An 11 minute song that is going so, so quickly for me! Lay there, I will tell you. I recall it. Hold on. Okay, this quiet transition now is beautiful, but is actually the less engaging transition for me so far. In this first listen, of course, in this first listening of the song. It's just simply obvious that maybe I will listen again this song later or tomorrow, or and maybe my journey with Haken is Haken is Haken, I don't know the pronunciation, is just started with the mountain record and falling back to your heart. Uh, of course, and, and maybe this one will become maybe my favorite transition, but so far is the less engaging phase uh, of, of the less engaging part of the song for me so far. Hypnotic weather, hypnotic, hypnotic, hypnotic.
on. What a trip is this song? Oh, this noise here is so spectral. I mean, so uh, creepy, spooky as hell. I like it. and goosebumps all over my body and my back and my shoulders. It's gorgeous, actually. Oh, that's gorgeous actually and I call it immediately a masterpiece yeah as a musician myself I need to stop sometimes the song because I, I really can I, I'm really able to get every single de detail in the composition as a musician myself I am a musician in the band Kills Rock Band and I'm a composer of my own songs in my band so I, I, I really I, I can really understand every single detail in the composition also here and I need to focus inside and to stop the song, but already I can tell you clearly this is a masterpiece. This is a masterpiece of a song. I can feel it. Nice action sounds. Nice drum groove, I mean. My friends, this is wildly beautiful! So nice, gorgeous song! Finally, the growth you were expecting from the song at the end, in a kind of starting of an outro, finally this growth is coming here. This is increasing the level, the distortion of everything, the loudness is increasing.
back to the 70s we are. Wait, this transition that is coming is maybe a banger. I uh, will turn back two seconds. I, I'm listening, it's starting a transition. I was expecting as a musician myself. I stopped, it, I stopped the song for purpose. Telling you that this is a kind of, we are back into the 70s, uh, beautiful. And here it's quiet, but it's engaging at the same time. At the minute six, a little going down the song, little, 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 but this song still remain a 10 out of 10, a fucking 10 out of 10 song. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10 of a song. Uh, you, you can, uh, the rating of the song is maybe 9.5 out of 10, but for me it's a full 10 out of 10 masterpiece song. without any doubt, but uh, as a little criticism, <laughs> I, I, I went mad for this song all song long, so let me tell you also one thing that is not uh, perfect for me in this song. I was expecting after the gorgeous quiet session at the minute 10 of the song, I were expecting of course a longer outro and different outro. They decide to put again the refrain and ending the lyrics with Falling Back to Earth, the title of the song, and then the sh a short outro very similar to the, um, the same riffs in the intro. And as a little criticism, I'm not a lover of this thing. So I think I, I, I'm ranking this song in the rating as a 9 out of 10. Beautiful. And it's hike, hike, hike because I'm really severe. And sometimes I can rank some song also a four out of 10 or a three out of 10. And I ranked also the hidden track in the uh, Morning Rise Opeth. Very good record, but the hidden track, I ranked, I ranked this song as in the rating a 1.9 out of 10. So a nine out of 10 for this song is really, oh man, I think you have to be proud if you are hacking fans that in the first listening are reading so high and hacking song and of course yeah I, I think you you have to be very happy and proud but I, I repeat myself again after the quiet transition at the minute 9 30 it is driving you perfectly at the end of the song I was expecting uh, an outro different from the intro uh, it's just too much obvious and too much abuse now that the intro is identical to the outro in a lot of progressive metal and progressive rock songs, especially progressive metal, also progressive death metal, progressive um, uh, metal and f songs, that the ending, the outro is identical to the intro. And this is a little criticism, but very enjoyable, the song Fusion. I felt really the fusion impact in the composition and this is outstanding my friends i have a lot more to say but uh, i stopped at the song several times so i almost told you everything in english just touch the window here for following me if you are new in my channel and you enjoyed my reaction and my analysis consider to subscribe the channel and a thumb up it's really helpful for me and for every creator on youtube and suggest me more I'm open wide for more suggestions and recommendations to this band. Suggest me more immediately now. <laughs>
for, for another reaction. And now a little Italian, and then touch the window and follow me in some other reactions I made in this 2023 here in, here in this channel. Ragazzi, mi è piaciuto tutto. C'è della fusion dentro, ci sono influenze di tantissime band, Open, Porcupine 3, uh, Avengers Sevenfold, Dream Theater, um, Ginger, Muse, c'è di tutto come influenze, ma non, questo non deve essere offensivo per gli Aken come band, perché anzi eh, dimostrano, secondo me, di, di aver creato un loro melting pot che è la loro magari formula, il loro timbro, è solo la prima reazione che ho fatto. Ho dato un 9 su 10 a questa canzone al primo ascolto, solo perché il finale mi aspettavo un outro diversa dall'intro, non la stessa perché è un po' troppo tipico. Ma a parte al minuto 6 una piccola flessione che mi ha fatto abbassare di mezzo voto dal perfetto e questo finale comunque resta un capolavoro questa canzone, un capolavoro, 9 su 10, grande, vo grande voto, grande cosa, mi è piaciuto quasi tutto e l'ho detto in inglese avete sentito molto bene, toccate la finestra per seguirmi in tutte le altre reazioni, se siete fan dei hack e ne parlate solo italiano iscrivetevi perché qui si parla anche italiano e ci vediamo la prossima volta. See you next time my friends, thank you for watching, love ya, from the bottom of my heart, from Italy, Giacomo James, musician. Ciao.